Hey guys, it's Ricardo and welcome to another blog tech tips. So guys, today we're going to actually look at how to actually fix how to actually fix issues where Google Play Store is not working on your Android device. So basically, if Google Play Store is not working or Google Play, you can actually follow these tips and with them you should be able to fix your device. So let's get straight into the fix. Alright, so if Google Play Store is not working, one of the first thing you can actually try is to actually check the time and date. If the time and date is actually wrong, it can actually cause issues such as internet in general not working properly or a bunch of other um, internet or connection related um, issues. So the first thing you're going to do is just go into um, settings. On your device it might be a little bit different. So I'm going to go to settings. My um, setting is actually on the settings general management. Once I'm in general management, you can see up here time and date. And of course, you can always use search in um, settings to actually find any particular setting. Now you notice that I have disabled automatic um, date and time. So what you're going to do is disable automatic date and time. And of course, my time and date is correct, but you're going to actually go ahead and set the set the date. Mine is already set. It's going to cancel. Then of course, you're going to set the um, time. All right. Once you set the date and time, everything should go back to normal. So you can actually just back out of here. Or of course, you could actually set it back to automatic time, but I recommend um, manual. All right. So once you set to manual and the correct time zone and so on, and the time is actually um, correct, you can actually come back again and actually try to connect to the internet and see if you're able to get the Play Store to actually work. So that's the first um, tip. Another thing you can actually try, guys, is as a second tip is if you're using a router or modem that um, controls your internet connection just go ahead and um, reboot the modem and of course you're going to turn that back on and of course you can actually also reboot the phone so just go ahead and restart your phone or power off and then power back up again and after that you're going to um, check to see if the internet has actually returned most of the times the issue is usually with the modem needing a reset or your device and also it might be that your internet connection is at fault so just go ahead and um, check other applications to make sure that you can actually browse if the internet is very slow you might also have issues as google play store sometimes loads very slow and it might seem as if there's an issue all right so it might seem like there's an issue if the connection is very slow next another thing you can actually try is to clear the cache of the google play store so just go into um settings on your device it might say settings and apps and uh, mine it says setting and apps on yours it might say setting application you might need to go to application manager then scroll over to all but in mine we go to apps once we're in apps we're already there and of course what you're going to do next is just to search for the google play by um, it's arranged alphabetically all right and there you go there's google um, play store and of course by clicking on google play store what you're going to do next guys is going to go to um, storage on yours you might not need to go into storage on your devices you'll have to go into storage to see the setting but once you're in here guys just go ahead and um, clear cache and then clear data all right so once you clear cache and clear data you can go ahead and reboot your phone and restart and test to see if the google play store is working again issue guys might be caused by your um, Google account so what you can actually do is remove your Google account so let's go to settings and of course once you're in settings you're gonna go into cloud um, cloud and accounts on your device it might be in a different location you can always use search to find the setting so cloud and accounts once you're in cloud and accounts guys you're gonna search for um, your main um, account and your main account should be under accounts once you're in here guys you don't know it off, of course you're gonna go into um, Google or um, your Google accounts once you're in here just go ahead and of course use the options on screen to actually um, select and remove the Google account or accounts once you do that guys you're gonna go ahead again and add a new account or you're gonna add back the same account that you actually just removed and of course by doing this and signing in afresh might be able to fix a bunch of issues that you're having with your Google Play Store Another cool thing you can actually do guys is to actually uninstall the updates related to the Play Store or just to reinstall the Play Store in general. Now um, on different devices this might go a little bit differently so let me just actually show you what I mean. So what you're going to do guys is you're going to go into uh, settings. Once you're in settings go into apps again and of course you can look for the Google Play or the Google Play Store to be exact. And once you find the Google Play Store and some devices when you go in here mine is a little bit different you'll see the option to uninstall um, updates so you can go ahead and uninstall updates right and of course later on you can launch the play store again fresh and of course it will prompt you to update back to the latest version which should fix most problems now um, on this device it's a little bit different you can only um, disable the play store which will not really help and so of course if you um, have that option 
or you know what actually to do you're gonna go um, onto the internet you can actually search for um, the Google Play Store dot APK now be very careful to only download from trusted sources and you can actually launch that APK file and overwrite or reinstall the Google Play Store afresh which should be able to update you to the latest um, version all right so if that's not an option and you have the option to actually uninstall the Google Play Store what you can actually do is launch once you go in here you're just gonna go into settings once you go into um, settings just go down after you um, uninstall the updates you're just gonna click on Play Store version which should prompt you to either update to the latest version or tell you that you're on the latest um, version as you can see here I'm on the latest version because I didn't actually do that and I didn't actually uninstall but you do get the idea here all right so it's gonna um, exit last thing you want to bear in mind guys is um, storage if your device storage is actually filled up what's gonna happen is that you're gonna have issues with apps on your device and also with the Google Play Store because it needs space to install new apps so what you can actually do to check your um, storage is to go to settings and of course in mind to be storage device maintenance um, on another device you might just say um, settings storage then of course there's storage and if you, if you can see right here guys it's telling me how much space I actually have um, free um, from 2.8 gigabytes um, used on um, of my um, 29.7 gigabyte um, SD card all right and of course it shows me that I can free up in this case on the S8 I can clean and free up an entire gig and of course these are, are this is the storage that's shown on my um, internal storage as you can see I have 33 gigabytes used of 64 gigabytes and it says available of the entire lot I have actually 30.5 or 30 and a half um, gigabytes um, free and of course you have to be careful if you have less than a gig free what's gonna happen is that your device gonna act slow and of course you won't be able to download new apps so I advise that you use a clean app such as the Samsung cleaning app here or of course you could actually use something like C cleaner or CC cleaner or um, crop cleaner or whatever they call it just go to the Play Store or should I say you could download or try downloading a um, APK and then installing that clean and um, launching if that doesn't work because you do not have any space next thing you could actually do is to clear the cache of um, various apps you could uninstall um, extra apps that's just eating um, up space such as games and so on or you could just delete duplicate pictures and so on to free up um, space right once you have enough space at least a gigabyte that's free you'll realize that the Play Store will start working again so guys this has been tips how to actually or five main tips how to actually fix the issue where you're having um, play store is not working right and of course this is for android device so it's regardless of until next time guys bye